complaint to CAF. Yes, Simba filed a formal complaint to CAF on the conduct and the language used uh, by the co-coach of Orlando Pirates. It's not only defam defamatory to Simba yeah. and to Tanzania, but also to CAF, you know. Who are we to start questioning, okay, CAF has made errors and vice versa, but this type of conduct and slander is unacceptable. And I think if we leave room for this to continue and spiral out of control, we're creating a very unhealthy and hostile environment in African football. So I believe he needs to be taken to task. It's up to the disciplinary committee of CAF to make the final decision. But as an institution, I needed to make it clear that these words were unacceptable. And we shared all the necessary evidence of how well we treated uh, Orlando Pirates. And now it's up to CAF to make their call on what they see as the appropriate sanction, if any, for the co-coach. Was it a... A document? Was it a one-pager? What was the format of the complaint? No, it's uh, an email. I think we had a 14-page document with annexures and evidence of communication and how it was well-received, pictures and vice yeah. versa. We needed to be substantive because when someone is accusing you of heinous crimes one way or another, you need to go on the defensive. But also to reiterate that if we let this continue, you know, it's like a... It's like a, you don't want it to spiral out of control. And today it could be the co-coach of Orlando Pirates. Tomorrow it could be, you know, Al Ali and Raja because they're at war as well. Sure. You know, um, so we can't let this get out of uh, get out of control. Have they responded? Not yet, not yet. I think it takes CAF quite some time to respond to disciplinary complaints. If I look at what happened with Burkan in Tanzania, the stampede into the pitch, disrupting the game. You know, the abusive language, you know, I didn't share this with the public, abusive language that I, I received after the game was unacceptable. But, you know, in due time, CAF, mm. after I think three, four weeks, they responded and then they were fined accordingly. What are you expecting or what are you hoping for in terms of your complaint that you filed? I'm hoping that he's taken to task. Now, what CAF will choose, whether it's a fine, whether it's a ban, whether it's a warning, you know, some... Punishment is better than none whatsoever. And even yeah. if it's little as a warning, just saying 